Hello everyone. My name is Humayun. Today we will learn how to start a dropshipping business in the UK. This total video series length is 2 hour and 50 minute, which we splitted into 22 small videos. While you are watching this video, if you do have any technical question, always you can contact me. All this contact information in the description below. Also, if you want to know more about dropshipping, you can subscribe to our channel as every week we are producing at least one video. So now let's go and learn how to start a dropshipping business in the UK. So what is dropshipping? Dropshipping is let's say you don't have a product but someone else has product and you communicate with them and you get their product information such as photo, product description and then you put it to your website. And from your website, once a customer buy this product, then you place the order to that supplier and then supplier fulfill that order. That is the dropshipping. But dropshipping has two types. One is automatic and one is manual dropshipping. So manual dropshipping, which I described just some time ago. And automatic dropshipping is where you don't have to collect the product manually one by one you can actually in a one click process you can import the supplier product to your website using api connection what is api api stand for application programming interface if any supplier offer you the api then you can just simply go to their website and then create the api as an example, if you want to find such type of supplier, then you can go to getshop.today and then go to dropshipping page. Then there you will find such type of many supplier. So now as you know what is manual dropshipping and what is automatic dropshipping. So of course the manual dropshipping you can do with any supplier. You can just make a phone call and if they are agree, then you can sell their product. But automatic dropshipping, it is a specific type of functionality definitely the wholesaler or the supplier should have that only then you can do that but if i say which option is better i would say automatic drop shipping is always better than the manual one the reason is when you are doing manual drop shipping every single image the description everything you need to download from the supplier website to your website manually and most importantly, almost 24 seven, keep on eye that supplier website, that how many stock they have, which is kind of impossible. If you do automatic dropshipping, because of this automatic API system, your website will track your supplier website stock automatically. Not only that, you can download all the product information just in a one click, which can save a lot of your time. So after all, I can say automatic dropshipping is better than the manual one. Let's move to our next question, which is the point number four. What do we need to start a dropshipping business? Any business when you are starting, you need many, many things, which is not possible to describe all of them in this small short video. But I will say to start a dropshipping business, three main things you need. One one hour of your time for every day because time is all about if you can if you do not have time then of course it's very difficult you're gonna get anywhere number two you need to have a website with dropshipping functionality especially automatic dropshipping functionality and then third number you have to have a good understanding of marketing so just to summarize that you need three important things one is your time which is at least per day one hour second you have to have a e-commerce website with drop shipping functionality and third you need to have a good understanding of marketing during this class i will do my very best to solve these two problem which is your uh, e-commerce website with drop shipping functionality and then third one is good understanding about marketing but the time of course you can manage your time and you know that let's move to the next point product sourcing 
Especially today, I will highlight it two important sources where we can find the dropshipping product. A. eBay and B. GT. A. eBay. Actually, you can use eBay one of the product source that you can source from eBay and you can sell it to your website. You may of course, you may think, well, if I get the product from eBay, then why people should buy from my website, not directly from eBay? Of course, I will answer this question. So, point number B, GT. GetShop Today has done a fairly new way to doing dropshipping. GetShop Today team contacted with UK very many local supplier or wholesaler and then GetShop Today has created a API enable website for them so that you as a retailer actually can go to their website and create an API and sell their product. So if you want to see how they are doing or what is their product, you can just go to getshop.today and go to dropshipping page and then simply find out which what type of product which supplier is selling. So just to summarize about the product sourcing, we are using two main source which is one eBay as well as GT. Now let's move to the next point which is how to set up an online shop using getshop today. Why choose GetShop today rather than any other traditional platform? There is a three main reason why I am choosing GetShop today over any other traditional platform. The reason number one, GetShop today has both way product sourcing option. You can source the product from eBay and you can source the product from GT. Now you may think, well, some traditional companies sourcing product not only from eBay and GT, they are sourcing from many other places. So that is the question. When you are doing dropshipping, this is really good point to start your business. But dropshipping has the biggest downside, which is the delivery time. Most of the traditional e-commerce platform, they source product from China. And when you are sourcing a product from China, your delivery you are expecting about one week is the minimum and it can go up to four weeks. Let's say you bought something in £10, will you be considered to wait for 4 weeks? Of course not, I wouldn't. So here, if you sourcing a product from eBay or GT, then you can ensure your customer that your delivery gonna be 3 days to 5 working days. So this is the reason number 1. And reason number 2, GetShop Today is the most affordable e-commerce platform out there. And you may think that, well, it's a business tool, money shouldn't be the biggest concerns. As a small business, every single pence is a matter. So point number three, which is GetShop Today is completely plugin free. You do not need to install any plugin or add-ons. Actually, what is plugin? Let's say you set up your e-commerce website and then you need a special type of function such as you are giving a special discount or a upsell function. In that time, you need to install a third-party plugin in order to enable that functionality, which is the plugin. Plugin can cause several different type of problem. Number one, let's say you are paying for your software, some company, ABC or any of the traditional platform, and then you need to pay separately for each of the plugin or add-on. And then it caused even a security issue. Let's say your e-commerce business is depending on multiple plugins and any of this plugin did not up to date according to the platform. In that case, suddenly you may see one of your function is just simply not working. So as I said, the plugins cause these three different type of problem. Number one, it makes the cost higher. Number two, it makes the complexity of the setting up the website itself and third number, the security. So now I believe you know why we are choosing GetShop today. Now we will see how to create an online store where you will see in a row three different video, which is one is how to create an online store step by step. Second one, how to create an GT API and integrating that API in your website. And also you will see another video, how to import dropshipping product from the supplier website to your website. And after you watch this video, I will get back to you where we will learn 
how to create a eBay developer account and creating an API and then how to integrate that and also we will learn how to import the product from eBay to your website or how you can sell your product from your website to eBay. Thank you very much.